Hello everyone, let's learn how you can remove the duplicate data from Microsoft Excel. If you are having a large data, for the illustration purpose, I have taken a small amount of data, but it is applicable for the large data also. Take an example over here, if you have taken a large data like this, so why I have taken two data? The moment I click over here, nothing has been activated over here, right? But the moment I click over here, table design will be activated. It means one is the simple data. I have just uh, filled with different, different colors to look like tables, but it is not a table, this one. But here it is a table because the moment I click over here, automatically you can see the table design will be activated. It's a new tab. But the moment I click over here, nothing will be activated, right? So if I want to remove the duplicate data from this particular data range, so I need to select this one, then go to the data just because it is not a table. Then I need to go to data. Then here we do have options called remove duplicates. Click over there. Here it is asking on the base of column name and contact number, right? Take an example over here. You want to remo remove the duplicates on the base of name. Just have a look over here. Intentionally I have kept ravi twice have a look over here ravi is one ravi is over here another ravi is over there right if i want to remove the duplicates on the base of name i just need to untick the contact number right and press ok inform me that one duplicate value found and removed right six unique values are remaining press ok let me undo this one again I am clicking over here to show you if you have selected both means you want to remove the duplicates on the base of name and contact number also but as you can see over here though Ravi is duplicating over here on the base of name but if you see the contact number this Ravi has got 317 last three digit and this Ravi has got 284 so it will not show any duplicates let me press ok it says no duplicate value is found because you have given a heading of name and contact number. If both of the things are matching, then only it will remove the duplicates, right? So here in this examples, let me uh, copy this one and paste it over here so that let me create a duplicates. Then we see on the base of name and contact number also how it is removing the duplicate, right? let me format okay so the moment i click over here just because it is a part of table anywhere in this table so automatically the table design will be activated i need to go over here and select remove duplicates from here right here again the same options i am getting column d and column e let me select both of these because i know that intentionally i have kept ravi as well as in the name as well as in the contact number the same number has been given so the moment Excel detects both the information which is showing is same, it will consider as a remove as a duplicate. Click OK. So it will remove one duplicate, right? So in that way, you can utilize the remove one duplicates. But always remember, whatever it is looking like, if it is same for the Excel, Excel only will consider that one as a duplicates. If you format this one, take an example over here. If you format this one, let me undo this one. If you format this one with, uh, take an example uh, as a percentage or as a currency like this, just because the amount is same, have a look over here. But you have formatted, a dollar symbol is there, but it will not detect as a duplicate. Let me show you. Click over here, table design, remove duplicates. Okay, no duplicates were found. So, so exactly it should be looking like same. Whatever it is looking like over here, if it is exactly looking like same over here, then only the Excel will consider as a duplicate and it will remove the duplicates. Thank you very much. Please like and subscribe for more videos like this.